guys that was me playing through gladiator uh, not through any arrangements that uh, i heard or following any books just with me listening to the, the great music of hans zimmer trying to put my thing on it so i could play it with the guitar so i'll take you through how i played it just using the basic chords and uh, like all good tunes it's basically not that difficult not too involved and yet it's all beautiful at the same time so the first thing when i'll drop this i put the synthesizer on just to keep the the guitar rolling a wee bit, trying to give it a wee bit more depth, but I'll switch it back just now. So the first thing I did is I'm playing with a drop D, so instead of the high E, just drop down to D, and that gives me the lovely D minor. So I'm playing in D minor, and some of the arrangements you hear of the tune is actually in that key. The only thing you have to watch is just think a tone ahead, two frets ahead. Say for example, instead of playing an E minor like that, obviously I've got to, I'm doing the D, so I've got to bring it up to F sharp, uh, to bring it up to an E natural. So I'm playing a full E minor chord like this. And uh, say for example with an F, instead of playing like an F major synth like that, I'm playing it here, there's the F there. Just wee things like that, and playing the final B minor chord, instead of playing it like that, I'm playing it here, and this is playing the D. It's a wee bit tricky in the go down because of the narrow neck, but you know I love playing the go down, so it's worth it. But basically that's all what I'm doing. The beginning there that you saw me doing is, uh, when I saw Hans Zimmer live, uh, there was a mobile player that came out and he did beautiful sort of variations and sounds over a, a, an E-flat ninth chord, you know this chord here. <laughs> really trying to do with this. Yeah, this sort of sound and the, and 
Ian from Glary, he was a Spaniard, so that's Spaniard, so that's so I'm trying to give this. I'm trying to give this Spanish sort of sound over the A flat 9 chord. Anyway, that was just me footing about the beginning. Main thing, the chords, okay? So, and as usual, the melody line's not that far away from the chords. So obviously the first chord is D minor. It's lovely with that drop D. So. Still, still a C chord, so D minor, C, then on to an F chord, I played it here, to a C again, I did a wee run down here, I had a, what's I did, I did a, a that's basically just a run down to an A7 chord, to a G minor, but remember, uh, I've got my D string tone uh, tuned, a tone down, so I'm playing the G minor, pull it across here. Okay, that's G minor, back to the D minor here. This is a lovely touch, the D minor goes to the A minor. So the first three notes of a B minor chord. So you can play here, even here. E minor. E sub. B minor. I'm playing to bring the melody line, line out. If you hold down a B minor chord, chord and play with it, start with the F sharp, F sharp, B, B, okay, then straight on to the E minor chord, A seventh, B minor, I'm doing a wee run down, to a G, E minor. Minor. Back to the B minor. And uh, the last part of the tune I play, although there's more of us in the film, but the last part, again, is to make use of this drop D. And I play the melody here, which is all in my pinky in 10th position. All here. between a 1 and a 5, between the D and the A, so, uh, I'll play it again, D chord, play in 10th position, I know all these D strings open. Yeah. Back to the same. 
sing melody and I'll play here. So again, remember the first part, D minor. Right. The second part, you're playing the first three notes of the B minor chord. You could play it here or play it here. Or you could do it here. The seventh. I'm going up in sixes here. Give you the basic framework of the tune, and the, the caveat is always is this is how I interpreted the tune. This is not the official chord, the official way to play it, or whatever. It's just when I heard it, and I actually saw Hans Zimmer play this live, he's all because fantastic, great film, great tune. And again, I hope some of that was of use, or at least something you can use to try and work on your own arrangement of it. So, thanks very much for watching, and I'll catch you the next time. Bye for now.